What's up? Once again, another Monday. Don't know what everyone else is up to, but I'm free. Yes, 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 Y-E-S. Finally on vacation, and the end result was I got three A's, and I'm still waiting to hear four A's. So your boy did good this semester. I didn't hear from uh, anyone other than the other problem fam, so let's hear from you. And uh, other than that, I just wanted to say what happened to me last night. So I almost got maced in the face last night by John Law. Okay. So the cop pulls me and my friends over because she ran a red light because there's nobody around. It's like um, it was late. There's no one around. It was red light. We were waiting there for a while, so she just went you know, out of the darkness. He comes, <laughs> pulls us over, starts you know regular procedure, and then all of a sudden he walks over to my sister's. My sister was there. So she walks out. He walks over to the whole window. He's like, "Okay, I smell weed. Who's got the weed?" Blah 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 blah. We got the silent. We stay shut. We were smoking. It's gotten real silent all of a sudden. Awfully quiet in there. And my sister was like, "I was." Like, okay, everybody out. Everybody out. I wasn't getting out though. I told Kaylee. Kaylee was when I was driving. That's my sister's friend. I said, I'm not getting out here. She said, do what you gotta do. He asked me to get out from my sister's side of the car, and I'm sitting behind the driver's seat, and I was like, I don't wanna get out. Or not, don't I have a choice whether to get out or not? I'm like, am I under arrest? He's like, no. I'm like, well, I thought I only had to get out of the car if I'm under arrest. He's like, you get the hell out right now. And he like, walks over to my side. And I was calm about it. He opens the door. I show him where the lever is to put the seat forward so I can climb out, but I'm like, the lever's right there. I'm sitting with my seatbelt on still, so I'm like, alright, so now I'm in the, I tell him, I'm like, I'm in the perfect position to get out, but before I get out, I just want to ask you a question, you know, I, I was under the fault, and he doesn't even want to finish, and he's just like, get the hell out now, so I'm like, I will get out without a problem if you just answer a question, he's like, no, you go out right now, so he pulls out his mace, and I was like, wow, is this really happening, I'm like, dude, I just want to ask you a question, like, fine, man. I'm not trying. I thought about it for a second, but I was like, damn, should I get mace? I was trying to think it was worth it. My sister's like, no, see that, don't do it. So I get out, and then he starts getting rough with me, like, all right, get outside the car. Boom, he puts me on the side of the car. All I'm wearing is basically what, actually, exactly what I'm wearing now. These shorts have no pockets. This shirt, this hat, and all I had was my wallet and my phone in my hand. That's all I had. I'm like, dude, I don't have anything. I was just trying to ask you a question and you're freaking all that out. So whatever. <laughs> she got a hundred dollar ticket and we were running the red light. Thankfully marijuana is decriminalized in Massachusetts, so we got another hundred dollar ticket for that. And he gave everyone in the car a ticket for not wearing their seatbelt except me. I made sure the motherfucking I was wearing my seatbelt because I wasn't gonna get out. Uh so yeah. That was my Sunday. My Monday, I just got back from umpiring a baseball game. I'm just gonna relax. I'm tired. I had a long weekend. So, thanks for listening. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching. Five random people welcome to our lives. That was a tale from my life. My next week. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Deuces.